Today is December 31st. We're at somewhere around eight hours of daylight per day now. Um, as, an, as an experiment this year, I figured I would uh, try to overwinter strawberries. And here we go, oh, look, we have strawberries. Uh, this is a day neutral variety that I propagated from runners of summer. Delis, I think is uh, what, what they're called. Um, but yeah, they're all producing in minimal daylight. So you can grow strawberries all year round in a winter greenhouse. Um, and actually, you, you probably could grow quite a few if, it was, uh, if the temperatures were even higher. But it hasn't gotten below four degrees, um, which, which is good. And I think that that and the combination of the fact that it's a day neutral variety has helped. Uh, but these guys are still flowering. You can see the flowers still forming on them. And uh, I hope that they're just going to continue to produce more. At this point, uh, the, day, the day is getting longer. So um, by the time we get to mid-February, which I mean is only a month and a half's time, we'll be above 10 hours a day again. And all this stuff in here will be pretty active. Um, I think adding some light to these things would be um, really, I guess, the key to getting it to grow. But that being said, I mean, everything in here has grown fine. And I've said, I said last year that, you know, the, I guess that the, the, the limiting factor in, in a greenhouse in the winter is, is not, it's not the temperature. And in an insulated structure like this, it, it'll never go below zero. Um, not, not on the Avalon Peninsula, I don't think, anyway, not, not based on my experience from last year. Uh, but light is a problem, so I have added supplemental light to certain parts of the greenhouse, and uh, I got this light here from from Migro, uh, which is an array. That's a nice light, and you can see it helps produce some nice big heads of bok choy. Um, but yeah, so anyway, it's been uh, pretty successful this winter, and obviously, you know continue to be successful it's um, you know the, stru the structure just works and with respect to food security well here we are I mean we're in the middle of the pandemic and there are issues with supply chain especially here in Newfoundland and uh, you know growing food is no problem here we just need to have the right science and right technology I think to do it and these four season greenhouses I think are are definitely the key Anyway, Happy New Year. It's going to be another good one, I'm sure.